Director Michael Mann, known for his gritty crime dramas like Collateral, Heat, and The Insider, has expanded his resume to include books now with Deadline Reporting. He will launch the imprint Michael Mann Books, which will simultaneously develop books for film and television. The first book to move project to movie project will be a prequel to his 1995 crime thriller Heat. The story will center on the characters of Vincent Hanna, played by Al Pacino, Neil McCulley, played by Robert De Niro, and Chris G. Harris, played by Val Kilmer, with more characters to be determined later. Mary, thoughts on the Heat prequel by original director Michael Mann? I'm I'm gonna sell that. Can I sell it? Am I allowed? Uh, not, you can if you want. Can but I just sell it? Right there, man. Well, I'm ready. You, I'm ready you, to let you go. You bought of this something when you're not supposed to buy anything. Right. Well, there you go. Show's going to shit. Show's what going I, crazy. What did it's I buy anarchy. I wasn't supposed to buy. The second thing you said, I buy it. <laughs> I'm but gonna, I didn't call you out on it. You I'm did gonna, say that. I can buy whatever I... I have a billion dollars right here. <laughs> I will buy... Wait, don't you dare touch my bracket. <laughs> don't touch his bracket. That sounds so wrong. Dirty. Um, I, listen, I didn't go there. He went there first. Um, I don't really like this idea. I love Heat. It's one of my favorite Michael Mann films, and Lord knows he's made some good ones and some stinkers. This is one of his best. I think it has the, one of the best shootout scenes in the oh, history easily. of film. Um, and these are some of the now most iconic characters in a crime thriller I think that have ever existed. And I don't think I'm, I'm exaggerating. I don't really like the idea of a prequel, even if it's Michael Mann at the helm, because if they're going back far enough, these guys are old now. They're going to have to cast like a whole new cast of characters, I'm assuming. If it's like this, their origin story, Val Kilmer can't play himself 30 years ago. I mean, it just, I don't like the idea of new people stepping into these roles. It just doesn't feel good to me. I don't disagree with you at all. Um, but there is something like to take two new actors that are on a, this kind of this path of greatness. And if you had a Michael Mann who was directing Fassbender as Neil McCullough and Tom Hardy as. As, as Pacino's character, and then you had someone like I don't know uh, Garrett Hedlund maybe as as uh, um, Val Kilmer. It could be, I'd say okay, interesting, but it is all it is so dependent on the cast. That's my it, point. You no, know, and, and I'm with you 100. percent Heat's one of my favorite movies of all time. Not just Michael Mann movies. One of my favorite movies of all time. I love that film. I bring it up as much as I can. Great shootout, great scene. I had coffee with Macaulay half an hour ago. Like uh, so many great lines in that movie. <laughs> I love it. Um, but I just don't. I think it's risky. Yeah. If he has a tale to tell, Michael Michael Mann, then okay, great. But you have to get the perfect, not even an okay cast, the perfect cast to pull it off. Yeah, and it's Michael Mann, and he's not like you know he did Miami Vice. <laughs> That's so. true. Mark, this is a buy for me, man. If you no think buy, you're selling. If you think you can, if you think you can cast a young Han Solo correctly, and you think you can cast a young Indiana Jones correctly, you can certainly cast De Niro and Pacino from Heat. It's a really, really good movie. I enjoy the hell out of it. But I'm not going to be sitting there watching a prequel to Heat that takes place 20 years before the original and be like, ah, oh, well, he doesn't really. He looks taller than Pacino. Why doesn't he just write a story? If then? it's a great story, then I want to see the movie. I'm not going to be so locked in. But if you really want people that look like the elder statesmen that we have currently, Val Kilmer. Okay, a young Val Kilmer looks a lot like Ansel Elgort, the kid who I thought might be Harrison Ford in uh, the Han Solo movie. So I'm just saying, in that perspective, this is a huge buy. I'm giving all my money right now to the Heat prequel directed by Michael Mann. All right. With huge your bracket. Buy. Hey guys, if you like this clip, click here to watch the entire episode. Also, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel because it'll help you stay up to date with all the stuff we've got going on here at Collider.